Let's get more now on harnessing homegrown technology for the fight against COVID-19. We're joined by Bala Abdullahi, the Dean of the Faculty of Engineering at the Kano State University of Science and Technology. He joins us from our Kano Studio Center. Welcome to Africa 54. Well, it's always good to know that people are thinking about solutions. So could you tell us, how long did it take the school to come up with this solution? Okay. Uh, you know, as a university, we have been engaging in, in different researches for different, uh, in different fields. Uh, maybe before I answer uh, the duration for us to come out with these in, uh, innovations, maybe I, I need to highlight that, you know, in a university, all the lecturers are having three major responsibilities. That is one, for teaching, and two, research, and three, community service. So since uh, we started graduating the student, you know, as you know, it's a prerequisite for a student to graduate from uh, a program, not only engineering, uh, for him to write something as a project, which will be a purely a research uh, project. So since we started graduating the students, we have been having researches uh, on different topics, uh, on solving different issues uh, within our environment. And also, uh, the staff themselves, they have been engaged in different uh, researches. Uh, some maybe alone for one to solve a, a certain problem, or a research that will lead to a word of a degree, let's say, yeah. for example, a master's degree or PhD. They also, uh, we have been engaged in researches to do with uh, collaborative research, whereby a team of researchers within uh, the faculty would now come up with a certain issue. You know, uh, as engineers, we usually define ourselves as problem solver. So after when this issue of COVID-19 crop in, we also swung into action to see how we can contribute in the two aspects, the aspect of uh, pre-question and the aspect of uh, uh, management. So we gathered, I think it took us about uh, one month to come up with the design concept, uh, which is later now translated into a, a, a real product, which we presented to the university, and later the university sponsored massive production of 40 units, 20 for right. each uh, of uh, the devices. So are we utilizing the potential that the universities have got. Are we doing enough with that? Actually, when we look at this, uh, to a certain extent, we are trying to utilize the local uh, technology. Uh, but there are issues uh, which now spread the, the development of using the local uh, technology. If, you, if there's one thing you like the authorities to address such that the challenges will be reduced and then the schools can do more. What will that be? Yeah, I think the, the best thing is uh, there are so many things, but I think is to create a conducive uh, environment. When researchers have conducive environment in terms of encouragement, in terms of, uh, for example, here still we are talking about the energy issue because when a researcher is doing work, he needs a conducive place that will enable him to think well. So once the authority provides conducive environment for the researchers, and that will encourage more of this uh, innovation and invention from right. our universities. Yeah. Okay, then that uh, is uh, maybe one Bala of the Abdullahi, major important. Dean, yeah. Faculty of Engineering, Kano State University, thank you very much indeed for talking to us today on Africa 54. Mm -hmm.